Good evening. My name is Eric Lennox, and today I'm going to be showing you how to we're going to be completing today's assignment. How about that? All right, let me share my screen, and we are ready to rock and roll. All right, yeah, so I'm presenting to everyone. Okay. All right. So first, you got to pull up your uh, your statewide data from the SPSS system. You got to want. Uh, it was a little tricky at first, but once I started, um, kind of play with it a little bit, we, we kind of got the hang of it. So what you're going to do first uh, to get the to get the mean uh, for the district, the smallest enrollment, the largest enrollment, the range, and the standard deviation. Um, I, I thought it was going to be a bunch of steps, but it's actually a really simple step. So what you do is you go to analyze, you go to uh, descriptive, the statistics, you choose the frequencies. I started off going down here, but I played with it a little bit more, and then I found the frequencies. So as you can see, I've already, I've already started. You put it in the, uh, you select the variables in the box. Uh, so of course I selected enroll and then you go to the statistics tab here. And what that allows me to do is it allows me to go click on what I want. So the mean, median, the mode or the mean, you know, just the mean for this one. And then we have our standard deviation and we also uh, have to set the maximum and the minimum. It gives you the highest and the lowest. Uh, so it's really like your one-stop shop. And then you click continue and then you click OK. Boom, there it is. Let me zoom in a little bit. Uh, I want to zoom in. I thought I'd zoom in. OK, anywho. So it gives you everything you asked for. It gives you your mean, uh, which is 1,956 students. Uh, your standard deviation is here. Um, your minimum and your maximum is here. Uh, like I say, one-stop shop, real simple process once you play with it, but um, overall, I enjoyed it. So thanks for watching. Have a nice night.